Do spiders eat birds? Welcome back to Shelby on Safari, the place where I, a wild animal biologist, loves to answer your animal questions. Today, we're exploring the world of the bird-eating spider, aka the Goliath bird-eating tarantula. So you ready? Join the safari and let's get started. The Goliath bird-eating tarantula is the largest tarantula in the world, as you would hope given its name. Their body measures about 4.75 inches, that's 12 centimeters, with a leg span of up to 11 inches, 28 centimeters. And they're native to the rainforest regions of northern South America. Before we explore what they eat, we got to examine how do they hunt. And you would hope that with eight eyes, they'd have good vision. But alas, the Goliath bird-eating tarantula doesn't quite see much. Instead, it does something pretty cool with the hair on their legs and their abdomen to do a sense check of the vibrations around them on the ground and in the air. Speaking of hair, these guys can be a bit noisy. Not what you'd expect from a giant or Goliath bird-eating spider. The Goliath bird-eating tarantula makes noise by rubbing bristles on its legs together, called stridulation. This hissing noise is loud enough to be heard up to 15 feet away. But do Goliath bird-eating tarantulas actually eat birds? Well, as their name suggests, they can occasionally eat birds and pretty much anything that's smaller than them, from invertebrates mice, frogs, lizards, and yes, small birds. They hide in underground burrows throughout the day, coming out at night to hunt. Now, the first European explorers in South America seem to have been particularly lucky in spotting the Goliath bird-eating spider actually eating a small bird, hence the name. But this species usually hangs out safely on land in those underground burrows, and so they're not actively up in the air or in the trees hunting out birds. So they're more likely to eat other things. In fact, in many zoos, they feed them cockroaches to the delight of my mother. However, there are some pretty snazzy tree spiders that kind of resemble birds in a weird way. Recent study has found that some species of tree spider, affectionately known as flatties because they're quite flat and they look like they've been smushed, drop to the ground when there is danger. In fact, those hairy legs come in handy for them too. For when they drop, they spread their legs out. And yes, their legs are also hairy and they glide like a little bird from branch to branch. However, if that wasn't cool enough, when falling, they actually first right themselves so that their bellies face downward, akin to the falling strategy of cats, like Peter. Then they aim their heads towards their target and then extend their forelegs to maneuver through the air. They then angled their hind legs in a backward direction, giving their body a torpedo-like shape. How crazy is that? The diversity amongst arachnids is pretty impressive, you gotta say. So yes, some spiders do eat birds, but it's not particularly common, even when you have bird-eating tarantula in your name. If you enjoyed learning this interesting spidey fact, give this video a thumbs up. And to keep your adventure going, why not check out one of my favorite videos in which I compared Spider-Man to a spider monkey? What? Go on, click it, it's right here. I'll see you over there. Thanks so much for watching.